Alright, so just the first pass with a quarter inch bit here. I'm going to go ahead and just move this out of the way. I'll give you a look here. So I'm cutting conventional cutting on this bamboo. And um, so far, not so bad doing milling out each piece here. And I will be uh, putting an eighth inch bit in here and cutting the outers and drilling some holes in here also now. So, But as you can see, so far it's so good on the bamboo. Well, I got the arm, I got these pieces done here out of this bamboo. Um, I made a mistake on the grain. I wanted to do it long grain, but I cut it short grain, and I didn't want to do that. I wanted to cut it long grain. Um, the cuts look good. Um, my depth of cut was 0.2 on the on the one quarter inch uh, end mill two flute I used for all these cutouts. Um, that was point. Uh, no, I'm sorry, point 0.1 down underneath. Um, conventional cut on everything, for wood of course. And then I did um, area clear pocketing for all these here. The outside was done, well the outside and these small slits in here and the drilling was done with an eighth inch uh, end mill. And um, that was also conventional as far as those. And then the out outer cut was the eighth inch that was done conventional as well. Um, turned out pretty nice. Circles look okay. Um, it's hard to tell a little bit, but I got a little flat spot here when it came around. I'm not sure why. Um, but I noticed that on circles it does that. So I'll have to troubleshoot that and figure it out. Because um, I don't think it, there's much backlash. I know there's a little, a little, uh, I'm going to just drop that one. Um, there's a little play in the in the gear mesh with the with the ring and uh, the rack and pinion, just a little bit on the on the the other side over there on that side. But uh, other than that, a little sanding down and uh, nice nice piece. Well, the cuts look pretty smooth. I don't see 
any concern. Um, when it does cut down, you know, I notice that the router does uh, flex a little bit, you know, but uh, other than that, I'm pretty satisfied with the, the quality that came out of this. Um, it's hard to see the circles here. They don't look too bad. Actually, look pretty good there, but for some reason, a flat spot up here when it comes around this this radius here. Uh, but other than that, the CNC mogul is uh, is is doing well. I just got to do some tweaks. I'm going to get a conventional um, spindle mount here because I can't get enough clearance out the bottom because it hits that bracket for the slide, and I can't. I couldn't even cut that last one, even with a screw. I tried because it was just too low. By the time I had to get down to the depth, I think it was 3.37 um, or 3.65, whatever the thickness of this bamboo is, it was already dragging across here. I'm talking about the slide. The bottom was dragging, so I gotta trim it, but I gotta get rid of this because I'm losing over a quarter inch of space on my, uh, my cutting length, so I couldn't cut that. But all in all, I'm pretty, uh, pretty happy with the cut. Um, I just used a bamboo cutting board. That's all I used to cut this out. So, And the whole time to cut um, for both tool pass, quarter and eighth, was about 40 minutes. Because I wasn't pushing and I was running slower feed rates. So, But that's it. CNC Mogul. First bamboo cut.